Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. In this video, I want to share with you how to get your Titan Bloods. So basically, why do you need your Titan Bloods and why do you want to maximize the, the, the gain of your Titan Bloods? For any given weapon that you have, there is four aspects. The first aspect that is already unlocked for you, if you want to maximize it and maximize the outcome uh, of it, you need five Titan Bloods. The second aspect, you need 11 titan bloods to maximize it one blood to unlock it and 10 to maximize it the third one needs 12 and the hidden aspect needs three bloods to unlock it and 15 bloods to maximize it that's a total of 18 titan blood if you want to maximize all the aspects for a certain for a specific weapon you're, you're talking about 46 titan bloods that's a lot and that's for one weapon so if you want to maximize everything for all the weapons you're talking about 276 titan bloods so in this video these are your six resources to get titan bloods the first resource is the first boss which is Meg or one of the furies her sisters and you beat her uh, you get your titan blood if you come again and you beat her with a different weapon you get another titan blood uh, but that's only for the first time you have six weapons you'll get it you'll be getting six titan bloods your second resource is Hades so once you beat Hades uh, you get a titan blood again with each weapon so that's a total of 12 titan blood this is the first two resources the third resource is uh, the fated list well, basically the achievements so if you go through the achievements there is four achievements that gives you that if you complete them they will give you titan bloods and they give you a total of 36 titan bloods when, when you go into the game and you play you're gonna kill the, you're gonna beat the first boss your aim is to beat the uh, last boss and escape so you're gonna get the first two titan bloods anyway uh, but if you want to focus on farming more, this is uh, the this is one of the ways of uh, getting up to 36 more titan bloods. The fourth way, beat Hades, you open something called a heat gauge. And a heat gauge, it increases the difficulty of the instance. So you have an attribute, and each time you increase one of the attributes, your, the heat gauge increases to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, etc. You can choose uh, different uh, attributes based on your playstyle or based on the weapon as well that you'll be using. But when you increase your heat gauge to 1, then you can go again with any weapon and get two more titan bloods from the first and the last boss and this works for every weapon for example you get the spear okay you get the heat gauge to one you clear it you get two titan bloods you come back again you choose the sword on a heat gauge one you get another two titan bloods so for heat gauge one you get another 12 titan bloods when you increase it to heat gauge 2, you get another 12 titan blood. So this is the fourth way of getting uh, titan bloods. And this and this is will be your main titan blood farming way. Uh, the fifth way to get titan blood is in the lounge there is a guy that uh, do trades. It won't be a good deal. So you have to look, you know, sometimes he have special deals, special offers. You can get 10 keys or 10 nectars and you get a titan blood. This is the deal that you want to get. Uh, other than that, uh, I don't in my opinion, I don't think it's worth it. And the last uh, place, the last resource to get the Titan Blood is when you reach the sticks. On your right hand side, there is a, a, a shop that has, all, not always, most of the times, it has a Titan Blood and it costs 1200 coins. That's a lot of coins and I don't think it's worth it. Uh, Hades is just in front of you, you can beat him and get your Titan Blood. Now, one can argue that, okay, I can uh, reset the heat gauge, go on zero heat gauge just farm or do a, a, a rush run go all the way there farm my farm the 1200 coins and get my titan blood and keep doing it over and over and over endlessly yes you can do that but for an average player uh, a quick run it's gonna be like 15 minutes to get there it's gonna be much harder if you're not spending your coin it's better to invest this time and try to push your heat whenever you push your heat and you want to do a run it's going to take you 25 minutes maybe uh, and this way you'll get two titan bloods plus uh you'll be progressing through the game plus no one likes farming so this is your uh, six resources to get your titan bloods the, the amount of titan bloods in the game are limited basically these are the only resources to get titan blood spend them wisely every other resource like nectars shadows gems you can keep farming them uh, but titan bloods they're limited in the game so uh, spend them wisely uh, spend them in the weapon or in the aspect 
that you enjoy the most and that you can play best the most because this is where you're gonna be progressing uh, in the game i hope you enjoyed this video guys if you have any question or comment please post it in the comment section below uh, and also please uh, follow me or join me on my twitch channel i stream mostly every day it'll be good to have you guys have a good day see you next time